God help me, I have no idea what I'm getting into. Welcome to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon! No, I'm just kidding. It's it's not Pokemon Mystery Dungeon at all. It's actually uh, Tronbon! The Misadventures of Tronbon. Look at the, look at the Lego. Look at the Lego boy. Look at he float. He's great. I love him. The surf bots are so fucking good. So you might be wondering, what the fuck is this game? <laughs> I don't fucking know. The misadventures of Tron Bon. But what I do know is, it is in fact canonically the second game in the Mega Man Legends timeline, and I've never played it. I don't know anyone that's played it, but I guess today we're all gonna find out together what the fuck the misadventures of Tron Bon is. What? Get get out get out of the screen! Look at all these fellas. So, uh, yes, this is in fact a Mega Man game. Uh, it, I am told it takes place after the first one, the uh, first Mega Man Legends game, and it is about the villains, or, well, the comedy relief villains of, of that specific game, the, the Tron Bond family. And I really like those characters. I thought they were neat. So the fact that they got their own game is really fascinating to me. They're actually probably my favorite Mega Man villains that Capcom has ever made. So, can't wait to see how this goes. Uh, let's see. Shot type, manual aim. For Mega Man Legends players, use the L2 button to auto-lock on targets. Auto-aim for beginners. The game will automatically aim for you. Well, I played through Mega Man Legends, and I beat the final boss without all the upgrades, so I think I'm pretty ready for manual aim. Turn left and right. Oh, no. Does this stu- Oh, no. No, no, no! We're doing this again? Wait, they didn't fix this yet? So they still hadn't figured out how to make a control stick work yet when they made this. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Here we go again. I guess I'll, I'll do the first one because that's what I was doing for Mega Man Legends. I will accept my choices. Yo, what the fuck's an analog stick? Analog? Ain't that like when you poop? I'm sorry, you you guys can go now. Hope everything sounds okay. <gasps> Yo, the graphics though. Look at them climbing up into the robot. They got little binoculars. <laughs> Teasel! After I went to all that trouble, oh, it's the same it voice actor. That's great. Money to get this treasure money. Map. It's a fake. <laughs> I knew it was too good to be true. I, I mean, love this dude's voice. A legendary treasure. Tieros, thank you very much for the gift subs. That easily. <laughs> Junk store owner, if it's the last thing I ever do. The junk store owner? Oh, where the heck are those ruins anyway? I've been looking for hours. <clears throat> this is the Gustav Bonbon. Can you hear me? Over. This sprite art's really fucking good. Babu! Nothing here. Sunfishy, thank you for the six months. Have you found anything? Over. I hate sand. Babu! 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 <laughs> what? A giant doorway? That's it! That has to be the entrance we're looking for! I knew you could do it, Bon Bon! Now we're in business! What's your heading? North? All right. Stand by, I'm on my way! Alright, boys! Let's go! So they're still raiding ruins Yay! to get treasure, huh? Mission, Mission start. start! Okay, wow, they're just jumping right into this! Huh? Oh my- Oh, okay, controls are just like the first game! Except I'm a giant mech, and I'm not just a small robot boy! Wait, is Teasel piloting this thing? How large are these surf bots then? 
Why are you not Tron? Because I'm Teasel right now, and he's great. <laughs> Which way is it? Let's see. Tron said to use the L1 and R1 buttons to look around. <laughs> Yep. So, no, the analog stick does not, in fact, work. Is... Oh, look at this. Look at this sprite art. This is so cool. Okay, well, they got, like, reverse up and down controls, I suppose. That's progress. You can use the directional buttons, but I don't think you can actually use the control stick. can try this. Nope, control stick isn't working. Let me see if the analog function works. Digital mode. Analog mode. Whoa, 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 Oh, this is strange. So, imagine, like, your control stick behave like a D-pad. With, like, no diagonal dead zones. This is very strange. I don't know if I like this. It kind of works, though. Whoa, 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 call the cop! Whoa! It's a reverb. What, One control stick be like a D-pad? Yeah, but not really. We'll have to fight our way through. It is 1999 Capcom, though. But hey, Ocarina of Time was out by now. They should have gotten it down. L2 button. Can I move when I'm locked on? What the f What the fuck is this? What the heck was that? Took the words right out of my mouth. What was that I just fired? A missile. It's a beacon bomb, Tiza. If there you she is. The R2 button down, you'll see a target appear. Use okay. the directional button to move the target to where you want the snap box to go. Wait a minute. Button. Oh, fuck. I, they now said to hit L2. Button. I hit R2. You tell them where to go. So this commands the surf bots. Oh, I see. <laughs> a bacon bomb. Okay, that's the lock up. No, you can't move while you're... Oh, no, well, well, actually, hold on. Okay, so to strafe... To strafe in this... You, um... You use the R buttons. Oh, this is so strange. This control's really weird. Hold on a second, let me try something. Let me, um... What if I use... This is gonna be... This is gonna sound weird, but I think this might actually fit my control scheme better. What if I try this? Okay. Oh, that's much better. And then turning with R. Okay, that's a, that's a lot better. I like that m way more for some reason. I don't know why, but it works. Hmm. There's a little hole there. I bet the servbots could fit in. This is some good music, though. It's kind of like Pikmin, yeah, with the surf bots. And then you can just tell them where to go, I suppose. It's like I'm Captain Olimar, but I've got a big mech. Yeah, they go and do stuff. Look at that. Did Nintendo copy off this game? What? Wait, what did what did he say? Can I send the surf bots in there? Oh, I can. <laughs> It's very cute. It's like you're- this is Pikmin, but you're the one that does damage. Okay, can I break this? Will they break it? They don't know what to do. There's a crack. Maybe if you hit it with something, it will open wider. Hmm. Does it- why are your little boys sad? Because they don't have anything to do right now. What if they- can they dig this up? No. What if- triangle- 
is like a melee attack or something. Okay, circle reorients the camera. X jumps. I'm assuming I can pick something up and throw it at that wall, but I don't have anything right now. I really like that image of Teasel in the corner, Desert. I love that image of Teasel! Teasel's a good fucking character! It's a shame that he's not around anymore. Hopefully, hopefully one day we do get Mega Man Legends 3. Some rocks blocking the road. What was it Tron said? Ah, that's right. Use the triangle button to pick things up. Oh, okay. So you pick up boulders. So I need to... <laughs> I pick this up. And I smash that cave. Let's do it. Got it! I don't know why a rock would explode like that, but whatever, I'll take it. Big money! I'm fucking rich! Also, hey, um, I hope you guys are doing well. I did not ask how your day has been. How, how have you guys been... What, what you been up to? It was fucking really crazy last night. Uh, there was like a tornado warning, and then there was snow this morning, and now it's like 60 degrees outside. Weather in Texas is just pure chaos. I don't understand it. I've never had weather like this in my life. When I lived in Southern California, we had sun every fucking day, and we hated it. Actually, it was very nice. It was weirdly warm today. I'm just glad the sun's coming back. I missed it. Now that the, uh, the winter solstice has ended, we are obtaining more sunlight, and soon my powers will return, and I will no longer feel like I need to hide under a blanket all day to conserve my strength. You're doing more motion graphics practice, making a food now. Oh, what you eating? Replaying Xenoblade 2? Nice. What's up, Clyde the Cash? Hey, Desert. Happy New Decade. Looking forward to the streams. Can we get a lizard fact to start it off? Uh, uh, did you know that there is, there is a lizard in the Bahamas that has a curly tail? Do you know what they're called? You'll never guess. Curly tail lizard! Crazy, am I right? Thank you very much for 29 months. I hope you're doing well, dude. They're in South Florida, too. They're very cute. I like them a lot. Huh? Oh, there it is. There's the ruins. That's a wonderful fact. Thank you. You have a lot of anxiety today. Well, I hope the stream can help alleviate some of that. Does, did you know there's a lizard behind you? Oh, yeah. That's just Leonard. Don't worry about him. Baby. Baby bots on the patrol. This is the Gusta. Yeah, this Come is in, Mega Mr. Man Mystery yeah. Dungeon. We're about to go into the first mystery Get dungeon of the game. Here. Look at him in his little headset! <laughs> I'm in front of the sub gate. I'm going to go in. He, he's about to stream on Twitch! Over. Teasel, is everything okay? How's the Gusta holding up? That's drawn. <laughs> Everything's fine. The Gustav's doing great. How could it not, after all? You made it. Don't worry about a thing. We'll be home with the treasure before you... Huh? This game has, like, What's peak that? PS1 anime aesthetic. With the 3D graphics and, like, the 2D polygon, like, 2D characters. This game is actually a prequel. Wait, I thought it was an in-between game. 2D polygon. Huh? You? Huh? <gasps> He's got bird bots. Oh, baby's dead. You're a hard man to find, Teasel. Don't you Who is this? Me? I'm hurt. It's me, Glide. 
I work for Mr. Glide. Lowe. Remember? Mr. Lowe? So you know why I've come all this way to find you. Don't you think? Wait! I can get the money I borrowed from Lowe back! Real it's soon. me, Master Miller. Once this job's over, I'll have your money. Honest! I'm afraid it's too late. The deadline is long past. Give it back. All of it. Now. Time to pay the piper! <laughs> <laughs> Listen! Time to pay the piper! A few more! Silence. Don't you understand? Your time oh, wait a minute. Up. Yeah, wait. The, the dude from you Battle Network no name was named Glide. They have a similar color that scheme, too. Is mine now. Come along. What's going on, Diesel? What's happening? <clears throat> I've run into a little trouble here, Tron. Don't worry, though. I'll be back soon. Wait, he's gonna claim his body? What, like his mech? You're not exactly my type, but if you want to play around with it, I'm good. But take your best shot. What does he mean? <laughs> He's gonna like repossess my entire body? Oh God. Uh, uh. Okay, so it's a lot like Mega Man Legends combat, except now I have, like, surf bots to help me, I think, in the middle of the fight, maybe? Go! Fuck him up! Ah! Is the game loud enough, by the way? Am I too loud? I can never tell with these games. Every time I feel like it's not loud enough, it's like way too loud. And then when it's too loud, it's it seems like it's too quiet. Your volume is fine. You're fine. Okay. Where'd he go? <gasps> Game's perfect. Okay, good, good, good. Where'd he, where'd, what? Huh? Where'd Bird Boy go? Oh, oh fuck. Duh, duh. Why can't I strafe while I'm locked on now? I guess I can? Yo, Chim Champ, what's up? Thank you for the 22 months. Thank you very much. It's almost two years. Huh? It seems fine. Maybe a touch too loud. What? What? What is the game or me? Huh? Desert. The boys are getting hurt. Don't worry. They, 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 they're okay with it. It's their job. Oh, did I win? Duh. Not bad. I'd expect no less from the leader of the Bond family. But not quite good enough. Ultimate Glide Laser! <laughs> uh. Look at them. Look at them. Miss I Sean, love them. We've lost contact with the Gustav. I wonder if Teasel's all right. He said he'd run into some trouble. It's no use standing around here worrying. I'm gonna go to their last known position and make sure everything's okay. Block D, can you hear me? We're heading out in a truck to look for the Gustav. The rest of you, wait at your normal stations, okay? Roger! Yes, ma'am! Yay! We're going on a mission. <laughs> Cocaine snorkeler, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you for the nine months. <laughs> it's very appreciated. Thank you. That one surf bot sounded like kid trucks. What happened to Teasel and Bon Bon? It was so scary! We were so frightened! Did they kidnap Teasel? Calm down. It's all right. It's over now. Mira, thank you for the 20 months! Bon bon? How far do you think you could punt a surf bot? How 
I would never. They were both taken away. Look at him. He's crying. Taken away? But How does a robot cry? I don't know why? So didn't tell us about it. That's oh, just Calvin, no one. Thank you for the 15 months. Thank you well, very much. Let's get back to the Gessel Shaft. We have to make a plan to rescue them. Let's go. Okay, what? so the Tron Bond family was in debt. And I guess Glide came to repossess what they owed. But he took Teasel. Dept. What could be Dept taking them? It shouldn't take this long to find something like that. What did what? I say? Dept. Debd. Debd. Dipped. Dip. Oh, hi, Limes. What's up? How are you doing? Thank you for the we raid. What's going on? How was Monster Hunter? We found it. What took you so long? Hurry, give it to me. What's up, yep, Ferret this Gang? This is it. This is Teasel's receipt for the money. What does it We're say? playing a Mega yeah, Man John. Legends game right now. It's uh, the second see. game in the series. I owe you. I, Teasel Bond, do hereby state that I owe Loath Inc. the sum of one million zenny to be paid back in full. One million zenny? Huh? One million zenny? My what God! What is Teasel doing with so much money? Wait a minute. The date on this IOU... That's like a thousand dollars. from around the time we were building the Gessel Shaft. Teasel said not to worry That's a lot of money. cans to kick. He said we had plenty. <laughs> and then he went out and bought everything. Just kick some cans, forehead. Tron, <laughs> should we make dinner for Master Teasel and Master Bonbon bon tonight? Who is no, Master Bonbon? Bon? Not tonight. But is that the baby? Ready. They'll be back. I'm gonna pay this IOU and bring That's the baby. Oh, the baby blew up though. <laughs> yes, the baby got like blown to smithereens though. I don't think they're gonna be home for dinner. So we have to earn money to get back Teasel. I guess. That's the story so far. Talk. Oh, I can talk to the surf bots? I wanna talk to this one. What headset you wearing? What is that, an AKG? Number 11, how are things going? Leave the flying of the Gessel Shop to me, Miss Tron! Of course, since we have an autopilot, I don't really have much to do. Do you know by, by pressing the O button, you can see an explanation of commands? And that if you press it when the cursor's on one of us, a command menu opens? When you want to give one of us an item, you need to open the command menu! Huh? Circle? I don't have anything to give him. What? What is this game? Naming? You can name them! You can give them presents. What? What the fuck? What, 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 what do we make his name? Greffery? <laughs> Binky? Timmy, Henry, Craig, C Craig. Wait, no, 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 not, no, not B, not B. No, go back. No, fuck. What, what is the back button? What is the back button? Begin. I want Craig. C R. Uh, A. I. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why did it? What? What? <laughs> Craig. Cray. Cray G. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Perfect. Oh. Oh no. Wait. Oh. Oh, he can only have four letters. Guys, we need a four letter name. It's. <laughs> Greg? <laughs> oh, this is really weird. I can't use the D-pad. I have to use the control stick now. G Greg? G 
No! No! No, go back! Go get... Mm. Gre Gre Greg. 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 His he name is Greg. Okay. okay. Perfect. Greg. Excellent. Excellent. You are... Why is it still say 11? Oh, okay. Oh, he his number is 11, but he is Greg. You cancelled. No, I, I... Well, I don't know how else to get out of this menu. Cancel. Huh? List. Is... Is Greg on the list? What? What is this game? Innocent young Surfbot who is learning about being different. A romantic. A slightly odd Surfbot who is always thinking about what to say. They all have personalities?! A harsh trainer who works hard at designing programs for every- What the fuck? This is so fascinating. Idealist. No good in battle, but is a master strategist. Makes plans for Tron. Likes to draw, but not a good designer. Enjoys paint by numbers. <laughs> That's so cute. In charge of armor development, has a contemplative mind. He's a very studious boy. Oh, did Zenny play this, Dizzy? He named, like, all of them. <laughs> How do you say this word? Co co coke? Coquetish? Coquetish. 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 In charge of bottle development, appears quiet but is a radical. Coquetish. <laughs> Short temper, works in weapons development and has a violent temper. Uh, I don't think I want them in charge of weapon development. Heroic in charge of weapons development. Loud and aggressive personality. This one is hard-headed in charge of a new tank development. Keeps a strict schedule. What? <laughs> this is so neat, dude! Number 26 is popular. They're a bumbling, hopeless surf bot, yet everyone loves him. I relate a lot to number 26. Except for the last part. It's you, Desert. <laughs> Slow, slow surf bot who is trying to watch his weight. <laughs> Happy apprentice quartermaster who works hard every day and has ambition. Achiever, no special talents, but works hard to make up for it. I am... I kind of want to know what they're all like. Jogs on the deck every morning? Why would a robot need to jog? Superb manager and organizer remembers everything he sees. A practical joker with a bit of an attitude. <laughs> Why would you program to do this stuff? Jellovert, thank you very much for the 18 months. You are now the parent of 40 powerful boys. They're all so powerful. I love each and every one of my sons. Clumsy. A clumsy surf bot who always manages to avoid blame. Why would a robot need to watch their weight? That's a good question, too. I don't know. Oh, oh, this is Greg. Greg is a failure. <laughs> a surfbot who has great expectations for himself. Greg? No! Oh, no. Oh, no. I am a failure. I'm rooting for Greg. I'm rooting for Greg. He's the best robot. Number 10 is a diligent, a, seri a serious surf bot who asks prim and proper at all times. Asks. It's about to say ax. Number nine is hurried, a sharpshooter known by his nickname, the gunslinger. <laughs> who given these baby bots guns? Corin Koo, thank you very much for the seven months. Thank you. <laughs> oh, here's another serious one. Who only asks that he be given a chance to prove himself. This is just a normal surf bot. They're very boring. They perform tasks he's assigned to competently. <laughs> this number five is strange. 
A kind of personality where you never know what he's thinking. Oh, I like this guy. He looks very happy. Quiet, a little irresponsible, is kind and very talented with his hands. What, his little Lego hands? <laughs> yeah, it's like, it's like a little Lego claw. What do you mean? Oh, a gourmet. Known for his appetite. Always thinking about his next meal. You see them like drinking tea and stuff in the first game. So they definitely eat. I think that's adorable, but also very weird. What does he eat? I guess food. They're, they are technically carbons, right? Carbons are just like synthetic life forms. But they like have to eat and stuff to maintain their like fuel systems. It's weird. Mega Man Legends is really weird lore. Uh, smart, works in development and field, a fighter and a scientist. Oh, a bit of brain and brawn, huh? Number two, you're, you're, you're all right. Number one is a fucking sniper! <laughs> Reliable. The first serve bot made has a strong sense of responsibility. He's the leader! All right, well, I love Greg. Greg is the... Look at Greg's numbers. Perfect. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Greg is the best. Oh, they have stats. Wait, what? Huh? Yo, how fucking deep is this game? Greg is, like, perfectly balanced. Look at him! Look at his stats! Sloth? Oh, sloth. He's got... There's attack, speed, brains, and sloth. What the hell is sloth? Is that, like, laziness? Uh-oh, these are the mystery boys. It's deep enough to have a grind if you so choose. I heard this game was really short, but it looks like there's a lot to do in it. And then you can, like, give them stuff. You can give them, like, presents. This is so neat. I love this. I barely even started the game, and I already really like it. Also, can I just say, this song is a bop. Miss Tron! You should send some of us out to scout sometimes. Did you know that there are items you can only get by having a scout? That was very helpful for you to tell me. Thank you. Uh, how do I... Okay. Um, scout. Which is the one that's playable in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Oh yeah, they they did have a surf bot in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. They also had Monster Hunter in Marvel vs. Capcom, like, 1 or something, right? Or was it... Or was that 3? I forget which one that was. Select a surf bot to go scouting. You can send one more out. No, that was infinite, sorry. Did I say 1? That makes no sense. That series didn't exist then. Mr. Fee! Thank you for the three months. It's very nice of you. Ah. Uh, select a scout. Surf bot to go scouting and send one more out. Okay. Wait, what? Oh. Who do I send out? Who's a good... Who's who's a good at scouting? Uh. We could send... Send Greg. I don't know if we should send Greg. He has great expectations of himself. I don't know. This could be his big moment, I suppose. Is this acceptable? That's not how you spell that word. That's not how you spell that. That is not how you spell that. <laughs> Choose an area for Greg to scout! I, I don't know. Area C2. Casino Town... Nuki, the Nakai Desert, Primiki Harbor. I guess this is like a whole new island because this is not the uh, where the first game took place. Sart Farm. Tekhe Harbor. Send him to the desert. Okay. Do you want to send Greg to Scout Area D2? Yes. Go! Go, Greg, go! Oh, Big Burkhart. Thank you for the 18 months. Thank you. And Winter Titan. Thank you for the 19 months. Hey, Desert. I was super happy for you when I saw the Mystery Dungeon announcement. As a side note, why is everything in March? I don't know. I guess March is like the end 
of the first quarter were like damn well close to it, and I guess that's the best time to like shovel out all your games. But yeah, that month is very full of games. There's no way I'm gonna be able to play everything um, at release. But uh, I'm hearing good things about the Mystery Dungeon remake. I would very much like to play it. Also, um, Big Burkhart, <laughs> thank you again very much. Very kind of you. Um, I guess I'll save before I do something that could make me restart the game. Oh, Kenju, what's up, dude? Thank you for the thank you for the bits, man. It's my birthday, but I also got laid off this week. Can you say something encouraging, but also speedrun it? Um, you are a super player. Thank you so much for playing my game. I'm happy birthday, Kenju. I, I'm not very good at saying encouraging things, but I have a feeling that. You are a very capable person, and you're a very talented artist, and I feel like you will find work very easily with that kind of skill. Thank you so much for playing my game! But no, I'm sorry to hear you got laid off. That, that, that fucking sucks. I've been there. I hope you're doing well, though. Hope you're having a good birthday. Let's see, choose which mission you want to go on from the map. Okay, we have mission one, mission three, mission two. What is mission one? Bank. Action level. You get $50,000! The goal of this mission is to rob a bank in town! Oh. What is this, Payday 2? Alright, let's get this mission meeting started! These little baby bots are gonna do crimes! Huh? Details. This time, we're going after the bank in Gold City. We're not going to bother with any tricks. We're going to land right in front of the bank and bust in. Alright, Miss Tron! We'll scout out the area for you! I'll tell you what to do with beacon bombs. Your job is to break into the bank and get all the money inside. Yes, Miss Tron! Miss Tron, what robot are you going to use for this mission? For this mission? I'm going to use the Gustav! I'll use the weapons in the Gustav to stop anyone who gets in our way! Alright, let's go! Desert, what the fuck is this game? I don't know! I don't know! I'm figuring it out as we go. I am as lost as all of you. What? Okay, serve bot. For this mission, you'll be bringing along several serve bots and a sniper. The serve bot sniper currently selected is number one. Uh, okay, fine. Bring Greg. Greg is out on a mission. He can't be in two places at once. We sent Greg to the desert. These are the other serve bots who will be going on with you on this mission. Okay, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Uh, okay, fine. Robot. For this mission, we'll be using the Gusta. It's primed and ready to go. We should name them all. Do you really want me to sit here and name 40 different serve bots? <laughs> Mind you, they can only have four-letter names. I don't think that many four-letter names exist on this planet. Desert, yes. Name number 26, Desi. I know- <laughs> Why? Because- Because they're a bumbling fool? Was that that one? You can name one feet. I'm not naming a serve bot feet. Up oh, here we go. Right, let's get what we came for and get out of here before the police show up. Name one Garfield. That's Is not four letters. Bus? All right, open the doors. What if there's people in there? It's it's one of dogs. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, that's not a bank. That's Wait a, a vet. Minute. 
How do you make that mistake? Why is it always this way with you? Whenever I ask you to do something... Sorry. Oh my god. No, we just blew up a vent? Call the and tell them to pick us up. Come in, Drunk. We need a pickup over. It's Drunk. They say they'll be here in two to three minutes. Two to three minutes, huh? Well, maybe the trip won't be a total waste. Grab what you can. Miss Drawn, I found some valuables at the animal hospital. Is that Lime's? Okay, good going. That sounds like Lime's Trunks right, impression. It up. really does. We're not moving <laughs> until we get 50,000 <laughs> Zenny, okay? Roger. It does a little bit. New plan. Use beacon bombs to target the buildings and have the surf bot steal what's inside. Oh, so we're just saying fuck the bank. Let's just rob everyone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's a civilian. Oh. <laughs> no. Go, go. <gasps> Look at all the money. Good work. Hey. What the fuck? This is awesome. <laughs> You're just blowing shit up. This is a this is like that mission where you had to protect the town, but like in reverse. Uh, how do I? Can I send the surf bots in here? Oh, I don't want to target the dogs. Leave the dogs alone. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Look at them go! I sent them inside, and he's watching TV. They're they're touching all the things. <laughs> this is so silly. What the fuck? <laughs> Thank you for the price. <laughs> Thank you. Good lord, this is great. This is a yeah. This is a really funny game, dude. Go in there, go! Oh, no cutscene that time. Why did they bring back fish? Because they wanted a pet. Let them have their pet. Here, I look. can I send him into this one? Go, guys, go! <laughs> his, poor, his poor baby robots just got ran over by a car! Why is this so good, dude? Go away! Go away! What else can I rob? <gasps> it's the fuzz! I just, I just yeeted a car. Throw down your weapon and come along quietly. Miss Tron, it's the police. It's the police. The still not here. Looks like we'll have to fight our way out. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so good, dude. Jesus. This is one of the silliest Mega Man games I think I've ever seen in my life. I'm so glad this is on PSN. This is only like five bucks. I've already gotten my money's worth. This is hilarious. Tessie, you just murdered a family? <laughs> Don't worry. They're actually just robots. Surrender! Go to the buildings? Wait. Oh. Oh, yeah, I need more money. I gotta get more cash. I can beat up the cops for money, at least. Duh. Go, robots, go! Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Go, get in there! Get in there, get in there! Go, go, go! Give me the cash! Almost there. And then, there you go! <laughs> Why are they giving me fish? Right. We've got what we came for. Everyone, get ready to leave. I almost failed because I got sidetracked by beating up the cops. Who is this? Why did I have to sleep in today of all days? Why am I so bad in the morning?
Police girl? Literally Pikmin. Duh. And now we're just gonna we're just gonna shoot her with plasma. Okay. Whoa, she's got grenades! Oh, you're not totally helpless. Oh. Get her! Ow! <laughs> Got her. Mission clear. Maybe the robot suit is just like really tiny or it's like a power armor kind of exoskeleton. You barely won. She put up a good fight. Had enough? <coughs> we knew you'd win, Miss Tron. Did you get everything? All right, then. Let's go. Yes, Miss Tron! <laughs> Wait, I'm not through with you yet! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Better luck next time, huh? See you around! Look at that smug ass face. Ugh, of all the nerve. Just you wait till next time. They stole gold bars from a vet office. <laughs> you know, wait, your vet doesn't keep gold bars? <laughs> All right, let's start the post-mission meeting. Give me a report, please. Instead of getting the city from the bank, we got stuff from the town. These are all the things we were able to get on this mission. Pork and fish? <laughs> Why did you take pork and fish? Here are the surfbots whose brains rating went up during this mission. Number four's brains rating is now two. Damn, got big brain. I guess they like leveled up. Base Clef, thank you for the six months. What's up, dude? Hope you're doing well. Oh, number five's brains also went up. That's great. Oh, everyone's getting big brains. Here are the Sarbots who have returned from scouting. Okay, number eight came back with some fish. Number nine came back with an apple. Just a single apple. That's great, good job. Greg came back with police lights. Fuck. What did you do, Greg? <laughs> Greg beat up a cop! <laughs> that's, the, that's the end of my report! Greg fought a whole police squad and won. <laughs> he is definitely an overachiever. <laughs> I mean, so did you, Desert. Yeah, but I have a giant mech. Greg is just one Lego boy. There he is, sitting right there. Number 11, that's him, that's Greg. Fucking legend. Everyone else is like, I brought a fish, I brought an apple. Greg's like, I beat up a fucking cop. <laughs> <laughs> fucking savage. <laughs> 
god. <laughs> you should talk to Greg. I want to scout first. Hold on. So we need to send three serve bots out to go scouting. I still don't, I don't know what the benefits are to this, but whatever. I'm just going to do it. Let's see. Jogs on the deck every morning. That sounds like they're good at scouting. If, hey, if they're, if they're like, you know, they're active and moving all the time. Absolutely. We could send them to like a, uh, I don't know, a, a fucking... No, uh, well, not not a casino. Where where could if if I were a jogger, I would want to go to like a farm, Sart Farm. Greg is a menace to society. <laughs> Lock him up. <laughs> Eldridge Bob, thank you for the bits. <laughs> thank you very much. Fear the Greg, where they have none themselves. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. The gunslinger. No, let's not send out the gunslinger. Uh... Who can we send out? No special talents, but works hard to make up for it. Number 16's an achiever. Hmm. We need to, like... We need to find the ones that are good at scouting. Violent temper? What do the skills help? I don't know. I really don't know. I'm I'm learning this as we go. Not good in battle, but is a master strategist. Would they be good at scouting, maybe? A young Serpot who's learning about being different. Send the angry boy. Which one was the angry boy? Who was the angry one? Uh, number 13's rude. The strict one? This one. Number 32? This guy. Let's send them to... the casino. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good place to send someone with a short temper. And then... Hmm... Number seven, serious. They ask that they be given a chance to prove themselves. Let's send them out. Maybe they- maybe, this will be their big chance to like, to show what they can do. I'll send them to, uh, the Tech Harbor. There we go. Gotta give him a chance. Can I talk to number 11? I want to talk to Greg. Greg, how are things going? Leave the flying of the Gessel Shaft to me, Miss Tron. Of course, since we have an autopilot, I don't really have much to do. Oh, yeah, that's right. He already told us this stuff. Can I give Greg anything? Nope. Greg is flying this thing. Yeah, he's great. Uh... Ooh. I kind of wish I could use the D-pad to, like, navigate this part, but... I have to use the joystick. Unfortunately. When I set it to analog. And it's a little sensitive. Can you name them from the list? I don't think you can. Doesn't seem like I can. How do I, like... Is there a way to, like, I can change rooms or something? Because it says there's, like, a gym and stuff, too. You have to move places, then name them there. Okay, how do I... How do I do? Miss Tron, what are you going to do with the castle shop now that it's finished? Let me tell you... I'm too busy to talk. All right, I'll tell you. You'll be the first to know. Yay! The Gessel Shaft is equipped with everything we need to get ready for missions. For example, it can be used to develop new Gustav parts. But more importantly, it can be used as train you serve bots. If you train, you can make a more active you can take a more active part of missions, develop special skills, and learn how to do all sorts of things. 
Still, all four of you don't have to train. You can train individually. Surf boss with combat skills can train and help with missions. Or the surf bots with science skills can train to improve the Gustav. Some surf bots have, well, let's say unique skills. And the only way to learn about them is to talk to the every surf bot and get to know them. It's also important to inspect the ship regularly by talking with the surf bots frequently. You can learn what they're up to in each room and find out all sorts of things. Talking to all the surf bots will help you when you don't know what to do next. Got it? Okay. Interesting. Okay, so move goes to other rooms. Who is this? Wait, is that Tron Bun? A Magic the Gathering room? That's her lab outfit. Oh. Hmm. What is it, number 30? Well, Miss Tron, I'm working on the way to increase the Gustav's energy, but I can't seem to come up with any good ideas. I think I should start with improving the energy tanks. What do you say? That sounds like a good idea, but it'll probably cost a lot of money. Probably. Develop? Oh, okay, so you can make... Like, parts for your mech? Wow, oh, there's a lot of shit to do in this game, huh? Gatling parts? Armor parts? Tank parts? So this is just Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. I think maybe, yeah. Kind of. More DACA. Gatling does sound cool. Select an item to add to the building process. P police lights? <laughs> wait. Oh, wait, you can cash in this stuff to make it cost less. Police lights on your Gatling gun. I I yeah, I guess so. Oh, there we go. Number 32 gained the special skill Gatling Gun Development. Uh, okay. Huh? Go to HQ. Uh, I guess I'll go to a mission then. Okay, there's the bank mission. This is level two of the bank mission. Mission number two is containers. It's a puzzle. So this seems like it's a bunch of like different kind of mini games that you have to do. The goal of this mission is to steal all the cargo containers from the harbor. All right, let's get this mission meeting started. Okay, robot. For this mission, we'll be using the Gustav tank. The tank is operated basically the same way as the Gustav, except it has no weapons. To lift or set down a container, press the triangle or square buttons. To jump, press the X button. Miss Tron will explain the other rules, the rules for this mission once we get to the harbor. So this is like a puzzle minigame. Alright, uh, surf bots. Uh, okay. I'll- I'll bring the sniper bot? Sure. I guess we'll just go! A tank without weapons. It has fists. I guess those are weapons enough. Alright, let's get to work! We're going to load those containers using the Gustav tank I modified for this kind of work. Wondering what's in those containers? I'll tell you! Meat? Top I think meat might be in those. <laughs> yeah, top quality beef steaks. There's four containers. Huh? Okay. Strong, Miss Tron. Look. I don't know, dude. That might be celery. Crab. Crab meat. 
Oh, fuck! What? In this season? All right, we'll add that to the list as well. Roger! It's probably just imitation crab. It's just, mm, it's just fucking cod, dude. Tank can handle big containers like these. The Gustav tank can lift containers a maximum of eight times. I'll have to keep that in mind when I'm moving the other containers out of the way. So, I'm, I'm trying to get the crab meat? I won't be able to carry them that far either. No more than ten steps. But I can carry these light wooden containers anywhere. These metal ones look too heavy to move at all, though... If I turn in place after picking them up, at least I can get them out of the way. Eh? Huh? I guess if I have to, I could put some containers into the sea. I'm sure I'll figure it out somehow. I'm gonna be really so, bad at this, huh? Did you get all that? Um... Not really. <laughs> Weren't you listening? If we no. get stuck, we can start over by opening a menu with the start button. The what? And selecting restart. So let's give it a try, okay? I'll tell the rules again if you forget. Just press the start button for the menu and select rules. Let's I keep thinking go. of that, like, Craigslist post of the let's dude with the imitation start. crab meat. <laughs> Uh, okay. I... So, I'm, I'm going for the crab meat, right? Right? I think? It's like Baba is you. Uh... Desert, you're wasting. You want the meat, too. But I want the crab meat more. You're trying to get as many crates as possible. Oh! Me, me, dummy? Me, big dummy. Okay, I want that delicious meat. I want all the meat. Okay, so you bring... You bring it here, right? Yeah. You have limited moves to get all the loot. Oh, fuck. No, 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 undo that turn. Go back one move. Okay. I nearly beefed it. What happens if you load a trash container? I don't know. Did I just run over a surf bot? Oh no, I did. Stop, stop trying to get under me. It's like a baby chicken. Huh? Duh. Okay, yeah, you need to put that in the ocean. Here's the crab meat. Oh, okay, you can use these boxes as platforms. Got it! You did it, Miss Tron! You got the crab! Hooray! Okay, there are still two beef containers. Can I just break this shit? Whatever. So now you pick this up, and then we carry this back. Desert, don't beef this up now. I've got it. Oh, this is easy. Oh, this is a game for babies. Here we go. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Go back one move. Go back one move. Okay. <sighs> What's up, Ruined? How you doing? Thank you for the 19 months, man. How do yourself? I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat this. Wait a minute. Oh, shit. No, I have enough moves. Here we go. Did it! That's the last of the containers. You've got them all. Congratulations. The last oh, Shannick, what's up, man? Guess I'll go to the next yeah, round now. Right. Let's go to the next dock. Thank you for the 17 months, okay. dude.
Got like a hundred thousand dollars worth of Omaha steaks. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the meat! Delicious meats. To sustain my robot body. Wait, ah, oh, fuck, I didn't mean to do that. No, 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 go back one move. Where's the beef? Okay. Move over, Arby's. Now it is Desert P who has the meats. Okay, so you can yeet this into the water. Um... Is there, like, a strategic place I can put this, maybe? Oh, it's so heavy you can't even, like, lift- Oh, you can't even do anything with this. Oh, I know what to do! Okay, hold on a sec, go back one move. You can't toss it, you can only put- lift and put it down. So you- you do this. You put it there. There you go. I got it. Yo, I'm really smart. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but my brain is like throbbing and massive and huge. Try not to get too jealous. Fuck! Go back! Wait, no, 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 that's, that's a waste of a move. No, 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 go back. Go over here, this way. Don't want to overshoot. Okay. One big box of meat left. What is the B? Is the B the beef? What is this? Oh, that's the crab! B stands for crab B. Ah, yes. Of course. Should have known. <laughs> Gustav is you and meat is left. Tron Bon is win. Yo, Big Genghis, thank you for the 13 months. The lizards smell good. Actually, lizards don't have smell. They don't have scents. So every time you guys call me stinky, you're wrong. You are lying. It is a fabrication. That's the last of the containers. You've got them all. Congratulations. That's the last container. I'm really good at collecting beef. All right, let's go to the next dock. Okay. Does it when you're going to Evo for melee? Oh, uh, next year. I hope to get my invitation in the mail. Hopefully, it doesn't get lost this time. There you go. I eat like kings. This is a lot of beef. Uh, okay. So now we have to lift. I guess these boxes in a very specific order. So put that one over here. Why does this baby keep getting ran over? Stop it! Huh? Wait. Okay, there's the crab meat. How do I do this? There's a very specific order to lift these boxes. I gotta figure this out. Hold on. You can jump. Oh, yeah, that's... I forgot about that. I forgot you could jump. But I can't jump when I have a box. How does this help me? Yeah, you can jump, but... I would still need to... Move this box like I need to be able to pick it up and then drop it in that water or something can you pick up the box under you why can I pick up the baby 
Oh, I can't. Servbot, please! Can you move it into the ocean? Well, that's what I want to do, but I can't move when I'm carrying it. And I can't jump. And I think I just wasted a lift. And now that's there. Can't pick that up. You can't drop it in the water. Yeah, I don't know how to get the crab meat. I, don't, I think I need to restart that. Or go back one move. Maybe... Huh. How do you do this? You have unlimited moves with the cardboard boxes. Oh, do you? Oh, okay. Well, then I have to get the cardboard box, then. Let me get this one. Oh, man. This is really making me, uh... Use my noodle. My big, my big brain. Okay, all right. There you go. Yeah, and then, and then you do this. Beautiful. No, that's wrong, Desert. You're out of lifts. Huh? There are one beef containers left, but I have zero lifts. Oh, fuck. Go back. And then... Oh, you can't... I have to restart the round. I, I beefed it. I beefed it and did not obtain the beef. You utter buffoon. You mean beefoon? No. Oh, okay. You're out, desert. Oh, all right. I'm sorry. You utter beef spoon. Wait a minute. What if I lift this one? Ah, okay. No, I got this. I got this. And then we make a little bridge. There we go. Hey, I did it. Got the crab meat. Hell yeah! And I should be able to get the last two beef containers. Here we go. Yep, we got it. Perfect! This is a really weird Mega Man game. <laughs> Didn't expect this. That's the last of the containers, Miss Tron. We got them all. Ladies and gentlemen, we got them. Uh, let's go home. Okay, let's head back to the castle shaft. Yes, Miss Tron. Did you just pirate that meat? Yes. We are meat pirates. Desert, what the fuck is that Luigi emote? I made it when I was very sick. I don't even know what it is anymore. I don't even know why I made it. Okay, what's the report? 12 steak containers, three crab containers. Got a lot of money from that. Oh, we got ice cream. Uh, a comic book. Uh, number seven found a shell. Very, very good, number seven. Construction on your room is finished, Miss Tron. I have a room? They found a very pretty shell. I'm very proud of them. I'm very proud of my son. My strange yellow robot Lego son. She lived on the couch. It's an upgrade. 
Intelligent Kangaroo, what's up? Thank you for the 27 months. Yo, Tron Bond, good tasting games, Desert. I'm I'm enjoying this. This is kind of fun. I've never played this before. So this is my first exposure to it. And uh so far it's it's really interesting. I'm not sure where this game is going to go, but at the moment I am enjoy. It's very charming. I imagine the devs had a lot of fun making this, because it just feels like a game that someone would make, like, just for the hell of it. Oh, who's the piano boy? I, I can't read music. This song's no good either! I just don't have what it takes to be a composer! You flat! No talent! Why do you say that, number 36? I didn't think it was bad at all. But, Miss Tron, all I'm doing is just making noise. I'm just hitting keys. I want to write music that will move people, and I just don't have what it takes. Without inspiration, I can't make music! I know what you mean. Building robots is kind of like that, too. If I just had something, something to stir my emotions, I think I could do it. But... Well, I don't know what I can do to help you, but I'll think of something. Okay? Uh, thank you, Miss Tron! This, this little robot has emotions? Hmm. Human music. Can I give them a gift? Do I have what they need? Robots are human too. I guess in this world, yeah. Uh, doesn't look like there's a give option. You know what, that's true. Um, Tron Bond and all, like, the, the people in this world that look like humans are, in fact, actually synthetic life forms. That's right, they're carbons. They're basically, like, reploids taken to their ultimate extreme. Uh, whoop, not that. Oh, okay, there's the number display, so it's square to display that. Um, circle gives you descriptions. What is, oh, this is the meeting room, okay. Cafe? No, there are no humans in this timeline. Uh, well, at this part of the timeline, there are no more humans. Number three. The chef makes the best curry. It just fills you up with energy. I bet it'll be a while before number 26 can make curry as good as this. Number five, what are you doing? Why aren't you at your post? I don't know, Miss Tron. Lately, I just feel so tired. I don't want to work. Maybe I need a vacation. Can I take the day off? No! You're just being lazy! No more goofing off! Get back to work! Yes, Miss Tron. Oh. <laughs> oh, no! I feel so bad for him! As I look at everyone, I can see it all so clearly. Everyone's talents, everyone's skills. If only I could share this with you somehow, Miss Tron. What secrets can you see, number 39? Let's go to the gym. You can't just treat them like robots. Oh, wait. Look at this dude fucking working it. Look at him go. Course one. Huh? Oh, Zen Mongoose. Thank you for the Prime sub. Thank you. Thank you very much. Wait, was that number 13 on the treadmill? I don't even know what training really does. 
Seems like you can only select these eight robots. Uh, what is the question marks? Huh. Let's train number two. See what this does. They are the eight robot masters. This is training room number one. Do you want to hear the rules for this training game? Yeah. In this game, you have to throw bombs at the targets in the back of the room. To win, you have to knock down a certain number of targets within the time limit. Each level is made up of three rounds, and if you clear a level, the attack rating of the surf bot playing will go up one point. Good luck. Okay. Left, right. Move, surf bot. Triangle button is pick up and throw. Square button, pick up, throw. Circle is eat curry. And X button is jump. There's an eat curry button? Do you want to hear the rules of this training game? No. No. All right, then. Get ready to start training. <laughs> he looks a little nervous. Uh. Oh, am I picking these up and throwing them? Duh. Wait, that's Glide. Oh. I'm trying to hit the other serve bots, right? Right? It's dodgeball. I think. Oh, wait, what is that? Oh, now I have bazooka? Oh, you're killing civilians. Oh, whoops. All right. <laughs> of course. I need to eat curry. Oh, I, I can't eat curry. Oh, nope. Now I can eat curry. Hell yeah. Give me curry. Eat that shit. Let me just say, yum. <laughs> Ooh, clear the field. Oh, this is tripping. It's just like Brawl. Was that one giving the middle finger? Wait, which one was giving the fucking middle finger? Try the next level. The police girl? No, wait, Glide is giving the middle finger! Wait a minute! That's Glide. <laughs> what? Is he? I, it looks like he might be. Glide, stop! You're gonna get me in trouble! Duh. Oh, wait, I want that. I want that bazooka. Duh. What? You body blocking, bro? Hell yeah. I'm good at this, dude. I'm thinking about going pro. I can't hit the back row. Eat the curry. Ooh! Yo, you can catch a midair? Desert, did you know about the Peruvian Iguana Man 10 foot tall statue? What? You just saying words. What are you talking about? There's a 10-foot tall iguana man! I, I think I failed. You have to jump and throw. Oh! Oh yeah, you can jump. Look at look at he go. This is a very fucking silly game. I love it. This might be the most Japanese game I've ever streamed. <laughs> to be totally honest! Like, more than Chulip. How did Desert forget he could jump twice in the same stream and game? Sometimes I forget I even have legs. Does that happen to anyone else? You, just, you ever just, like, look down and go like, Damn, yo, I got feet. I got toes. Sometimes I even get like, I become aware of my duodenum. That's always weird. Ow! 
Fuck! Desert, you're so cultured. Oh, well, thank you. Bro, you ever just, like, look in the mirror and be like, holy fuck, I got a uvula. <laughs> nah, that's weird. Nah, I, I, I don't even know what a uvula is. What is that? Okay, Desert, chill out. No, 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 let's take this farther. You are now aware of your eyelids. You can feel them shutting over your eye. You can hear them making the, the, the gooey closing sound, but they go like... Think about it. Think about it. Thank you, Desert. You're welcome. I'm gonna fail again. I want that- I need the bazooka, though! Please give me bazooka. I'm doing worse. You are now aware of your Pylord Sphincter. And all the food that passes through it. Into your intestine. <laughs> You are now aware of your fun dick portion of your stomach! You can feel it move. How do we get on the subject? What is this game doing to me? Yeah. I don't know, does it, and I hate it. You're welcome. Have a great day! Ooh! Cleared the field, dude! Ooh! Oh, I want the bazooka. I want the bazooka. Bazooka! Bazooka! <laughs> That's curry. What does the curry even do? Ah, uh, please! What, 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 what? Ah. I need 35! Come on! Duh. Fuck! You eat it, that's it. It stops the timer. Oh, okay. It's like a little snack break. Ow! This is hard. Huh? You ever just become aware of your epidermis? Does you keep aiming for singles? I'm trying! I'm trying to get doubles. Your what? Your epidermis! It's your skin chat. Okay, there's a bazooka. Go! Get it, get it, get it! Yeah! Again! More bazooka! More daka! Still not enough. This is really hard. I'm gonna be thinking about the song in my sleep tonight. going for singles again. I gotta stop doing that. Ah, I'm doing it again! Ow. Ugh. Gotta catch it. No! There we go. Go! Okay, there we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck. There we go. Stop the clock! Desert, can I have your skin? No, I kind of need that right now. Ask me later when I'm done with it. No! Oh! I'm not gonna get it. I'm not gonna get it. I'm not gonna get it! Game is hard. Okay, one more try. One more try, chat. One more try. Desert, can I have your left shin?
What did the... What did the... the, the <laughs> what was their, uh, their, their name in Hunter Hunter? The... Aluka. Yeah, when they asked for, like, the lady's brain. <laughs> it was like, give me your spleen! I can't do that! Okay, well then, give me your spine! I can't do that! Alright, well then, give me your brain! Or was it liver? But if you say no three times, you'll explode. Please give organs. This is this is very difficult. I'll have you know. I'll have you know how hard this is. No! I was so close. I nearly got it. Did you guys see like the thing I tweeted the other day? Um, the smelloscope. It lets you smell in like the fourth dimension, and you can own in on like certain s stenches. You hold it up to your nose and you inhale deeply. Desert, that's a Futurama gag. No, they—they're actually making it real, and I don't. <laughs> It looks so stupid! So you can identify who it is that actually stinks, who really smelt it, and who really dealt it. This is tech we need. They can't keep getting away with it. I, I keep, I keep failing this. Please, give me two. Give me a double. Ah! Give me a double. Fuck! No. Yeah, bazooka. All right. Well, I can get it with the bazooka pretty easily. <laughs> Throw bomb. Ow! You're 100% certain it was some kind of joke thing. No, that was like a thing that like the state of Michigan was making. Like, I don't even really know why. This tripping mechanic has gotta go. It better not be in Mega Man Legends Ultimate. I don't, I don't think I'm good at this minigame, fellas. I think this this might be uh this might be one I have to take the L on. As Dr. Phil would say. Take the L, bitch. Okay, one more try. One more try. I got this. Ow! Desert, don't quit. I'm not gonna quit. I got it! Just catch the ball! Catch it! There you go. Ugh. No, 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 you're wasting my bazooka! No, don't waste my bazooka! What are you doing? Uh-uh. Duh. Oh! Hell yeah! Getting doubles is hard, dude. Without the bazooka? I don't know why. Give. Ow! Okay, give, 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 give. No, that's curry. I don't want that. Huh. Huh. Duh. 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 Ooh! Ooh! Fucking did it! 36. Booyah! That was easy. Game for babies. Try the next level. Oh, no. <laughs> 40? Uh. Oh. Oh, no. 
I could do this. I could do this. No, I got this. I'm, I'm gonna master this game. It'll be easy. Ah. Ah. Huh. Get it! Go! Go! Huh. Huh. Yo, I'm a fucking master! Yo, masterful! Bro, I'm so good at handling balls! What the fuck? Hell yeah! Duh. Okay, come on, come on. Throw another one, throw another one. Come on, give me a bazooka. Bah. Bah. Ah, ah, no, bazooka! No! I got stun locked. I almost had and I got stun locked. Fuck. I choked. Give bazooka. Give bazooka. Give bazooka. No! <gasps> no, 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 Oh, fuck. I did not mean to jump there. Catch. Okay, bazooka time. Brother, when will the bazooka be ready? Need another bazooka, please. Curry, curry, curry. Okay. Huh. I guess. Oh, okay. You kind of gotta watch where the other like little guy is running around, I suppose, and aim for like where they're close to, so that way they can put things up faster. I think I understand the strategy behind this game. It's deep and intricate. Yeah, there you go. You wanted to put shit up as fast as possible. Ow! Ah! Uh. Uh. Why are you prioritizing the back row first? I don't know. It just feels good, I guess. It's first day. First day tossing balls around. Oh, this is bad. Oh, I'm doing really bad now. Ah! Uh, wow. Doing really bad now. Fuck! No! No! Ah! Why is the game so hard? This isn't even as bad as it gets. All right, well, some of us are really good at the handling the, the, you know, the exploding balls, and some of us are really bad at it, and I'm particularly bad at it. I thought I was good at it, but I guess I'm not. Sometimes, you know, you don't get to live out your dreams. Just not meant for it. I don't know why I'm jumping. Stop jumping! Oh my god. Stop tripping! He keeps fucking tripping! Sakurai, please. Bro, you are tripping balls. Very good pun. You need to train him. I did not- I did not want to jump there. I don't know why I jumped. Why did I do that? Father, I cannot click the balls. <laughs> Father, I cannot click the menu. Father, I cannot click the book. This 
fucking loop. Gift out! Okay, I got this. Bazooka. Go! 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 Ooh, boy! There we go. Oh no, now it's... There's not enough of them up! I think I just wasted the bazooka. 30. No! 32. Oh my god! So what do you get for beating this? I bet you, like, beat the whole game, right? This is it? This is, like, the hardest thing you can do in the game? I want to see what happens when I win. You get one zenny. You get the true ending. Ooh. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Huh! Going there. Okay, eat the curry. Ow! You obtain the Triforce. You unlock the marriage ending. I can do this. Come on. Yeah. Oh. Fuck. Should I keep doing this, or should I just stop? I feel like I'm not gonna beat this. You should stop. You should stop. Take the L. Okay. You are close. Please stop. All right. It's not getting any easier. Well, that was fun. What, what else can we do? Getting the target score at even higher difficulties is nigh impossible, but there are stat-boosting items you can use instead. Oh, okay. Um, Taryn, thank you for the Prime sub, thank you! Hey, does it actually watch your uploads on YouTube, believe it or not? I try to remember to use these Twitch Prime subs, but I'm not on here much. Well, that's okay, I'm glad someone's watching them, thank you very much! It's a- it's- the support is appreciated, thank you! It's good to know that, that people are actually watching those. I, I upload those for you guys. Ruins free. I don't think I've done this one yet. What? Where is... Okay, dig out. RPG? What is this? The goal of this mission is to find the legendary Aurora Stones in the, in the ruins. Eh? All right, let's get this mission meeting started. Huh? We're going to go on a dig in the Shalakun ruins, looking for the Aurora Stones. Dig? Ruins? You mean like underground, Miss Tron? That's right. It's as big as a city, all underground. According to the information our scout brought back, there's all sorts of traps all over the ruins, so we'll have to be extra careful. Yes, Miss Tron! We'll be careful and stay close to you! No, you won't. I'm staying here! We'll take advantage of the other diggers there and get the treasure before them! People will trust you more because of your looks. That's why you're going, and I'm not. Y yes, Miss Tron! Do you think it's safe? I'm scared of caves. I'm afraid of the dark. But since I'm worried about you going alone, I'll be monitoring you using the m minor m mini, mini robot Finkel. <laughs> the mini robot Finkel. I'll tell you what to do using it. I love the names they give the robots. All you have to do is follow the beacon bombs, okay? And no goofing off! You get this, Tron! It's 
really important on this mission to listen to what people say. If you do, it'll be easier to solve the traps and puzzles. Are you ready to go? Ready, Miss Tron! What, what robot do I have? Oh, look, it's like a little piggy. For this mission, we'll be using the mini robot Finkel. It's operated basically the same way as school stuff, except it has no weapons. As the surf bots will be the ones doing the actual work, you'll need to watch them. Use bacon bombs to get them to talk with people or explore rooms and get items. Miss Tron will explain the other rules for this mission once we get to the ruins. It's like a mob of criminal kindergartners. <laughs> yeah. Look at them. Let's go get that treasure. Miss Tron, how are we supposed to get it? What's it dig out? Well, first it's we'll a have to find the digger and get some information. Information, great. Okay then, follow me. I'll use the Finkel to show you where to go. The Finkel is basically controlled the same way as the Gustav. If you press the square button while holding down the R2 button, you can fire a beacon bomb. If you press just the square button, you can make the Finkel ram something. The Finkel. If you fire a beacon bomb, you want us to go check out whatever you fired it at. It's Pikmin right? mode, yeah. That's right. And if there's a person there, talk to him or her. I thought we weren't supposed to talk to strangers. Don't worry. I'll be right there with you. The Finkel can make a funny sound if you press the triangle button, which will get people's attention. What, does a fart? All right, Miss Tron. We'll do our best. Okay, do you understand everything? Uh, yeah. Here we go. Roger. What does it do when you press triangle? <laughs> <laughs> Huh. It's the whole bunch of noises, huh? Oh, wow. Tron Bond is teaching these little kids to be criminals. Basically, yeah. <gasps> Let's see. One, two, three. There are three of them. It's weird how the UI moves around. It's immersive. Look, there's a digger. Why don't you go talk to him? Okay. Okay. So. Oh, I just shoot a bomb at their face. Hello there, Mr. Digger. <laughs> nice weather we're having, isn't it? Huh? Are you fellas diggers too? Yeah! <laughs> He's so Treasure. nervous! You mean the Aurora Stones? You won't find any here. You'll have to go deeper into the caves. Yo, is that Goku? Ooh! Do you know where they are? <laughs> he has Goku's hair! Not really, but I do know that there's supposed to be three stones here. Say, wanna come along with me? We can look for them together. <gasps> no! Uh, just a second. Miss Tron? Hmm. He doesn't look very dependable. Settle. This is a bad nice idea. Dance. Nice to meet you. Here's dance? Nice to meet you. Wait, so we got a new party member? Hey. Oh, you can push him around. Uh, okay. Well, I guess he's not coming with us. Ah! Ah! Get up! I get so... Oh. Uh, okay. Don't worry about him. All right. Eh? Go! Miss Tron, it looks like there was a cave in here. Well, you are in a cave. We need something that can drill a hole if we want to keep going on. A cave in, huh? 
I've got just the thing. This, my ultra dynamite. If we use this, ultra dynamite, what? as opposed dynamite. to regular dynamite. Dynamite's pretty amazing stuff. Let's leave for now. I'll make a drilling machine and we can come back later, all right? Let's come back later, all right, Mr. Dance? <laughs> all right, if you say so. I really wanted to use my dynamite. This is such an anime game. <laughs> this, this is so silly and weird. I love it. You don't get, like, experimental games like this anymore, really. What is this? Oh, yeah, you gotta make them open it. Look how happy they are! Huh? It's empty. <gasps> Someone must have gotten here and opened it before us. Who oh, done it? There's no treasure left anywhere? Not necessarily. Not all treasure boxes are this easy to open. Some treasure boxes are locked, which means you can't open them without the key. A key, huh? But that means we have to find the key first. This is starting to sound pretty hard. Do you think we can read it to it? Don't worry, I'm with you, remember? Come on, let's keep moving. Yes, Mr. Dance. It's kind of like, um... Like a first-person dungeon crawler, I suppose. Is, is Are these randomly generated, or are they just, um... Like, preset maps? <gasps> it's the same every time. Oh, is it? Oh, that's a little disappointing. They are preset. Oh, okay. <sighs> Can surfbots feel pain? It's a trap. There's probably plenty of them down here. It's a trap. If you can't get past this, then you're not worthy of being called a digger. Traps like these usually have an off switch somewhere around. A switch? Where? Where? Let's They're directly behind switch. it. Switch. There. There it is. If we push that blue switch, the trap should stop. Just you watch. Duh! <laughs> He's fucking dead! <laughs> this is a nasty trap. Holy shit! Say, maybe you should push the switch Fucking dumb ass. Yeah, that's it. Why don't you try? God, there's like... Is this like blood coming out of his fucking face? I guess it's up to you guys then. Good lord. Yes, Miss Troy. Carbons bleed? Yes, they do. Listen carefully. I shoot a beacon bomb over there. You can push the switch, all right? But, but Miss Troy, what happens if we get hit by the big ball? Don't worry. I'll time it just right so that you won't. But if I don't, well... <laughs> well, we'll see what happens. Don't we'll see what happens. But let me try. Quiet. Stop your whining. Do you understand what you have to do? Yes, Miss Troy. God, it was suck being a server. <laughs> oh. And lock onto his ass. Did you see the boy jump? What's he doing? What are you do? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Stop! I didn't send you over there yet. Okay. So go. <laughs> Good job. Only oh, one made it. <laughs> oh, he still got hit anyways. Right? 
He got hit anyways when it came to a stop! <laughs> I guess we must go deeper into the dungeon then. So, I, I is this game just like, it, it's a series of mini games where eventually you advance a plot after completing enough of them, so it's kind of like, hey, you Pikachu in some sense? Am I right about that? Basically, yeah. All right. Interesting idea. So how long is this game typically? Fire trap. Fire? Yep. If you're not careful, you'll be burned to a crisp. It's a Pika like. Mm, I see. Well, what should we do? Well, this trap should also have a switch that deactivates it somewhere. So all we have to do is find it and push it, right? That's right. But what are you standing around for? Let's look for that switch. I have a switch on my desk. <gasps> oh, it's over there. I can't get close to it. What happens if a surf bot gets close to it? Ah! Oh, they can go over it. That takes care of that. Good job, boys. It's eight to 10 hours like according to how long to beat. Okay, they that's that's not bad. Dinners, but I that's like two or three streams. I like the amount of variety this game has. It seems like they were just trying a lot of different ideas for games and just kind of like throwing them all into one like Mega Man themed adventure, which is really interesting. You know, you don't really expect that from this series at all. Oh yeah, that's right. That's that button. How do I break this? Square. I thought you meant this was short, short, like one stream. I mean, I would like to, I would like to play through this. This is, it's, it's fun. It's really weird and interesting. I can't really think, I can't really think of any other games like it. Hey, what's this? That's a card key for a treasure box. Good job. This means you can open locked treasure boxes now. I mean, I can't even think of indie games like this. This is like really unique. <sighs> Listen to me. That's really important. Don't lose it, all right? Yes, Miss Tron. We'll take good care of it. Games like this are super fascinating. We just established it was like, hey, you Pikachu. Sort of, yeah, except you're not yelling at, like, a yellow rodent the entire time for several hours on end and pissing off your parents. You can play this game silently without annoying your entire household. Well, you are looking at yellow robots. Okay, well, that's true. I guess there are some similarities here. However, they do send- they tend to listen a lot more than it's Pikachu did. Strong. Look at what was inside! An e-bottle! Number one! Number one! Wait, I can use it to recharge the Finkel's energy! Take good care of it! Wait, I have energy? Yes, Miss Tron! <gasps> Is Mega Man even in this? I don't know! Oh yeah, I do have energy. So wait, I can take damage? It's an ancient sippy cup. <laughs> yeah. It has a little straw on everything. This is the Dark Souls of Hey You Pikachu games. Oh wait, no, I'm going backwards now. Oh yeah, there was a little Mega Man 8-bit sprite on the TV. Uh-oh. Let Phil sneeze. I feel a sneeze come. Okay, it's gone. I got sneeze teased again. <laughs> God, I hate that shit. Getting sneeze teased is the fucking worst. 
Cut it out! Cut it out! Uh, Sneeze bald. Huh? Don't bother me. I'm trying to disarm this trap and I'm not in a good mood right now. Trap? What kind of trap? It's up ahead. You get close and rocks start to fall from the ceiling. You can't get through. Why don't you push the amount of voice acting in this is also rather impressive. Huh? For like a silly little side game. That. What do you think I am? Some kind of idiot? You trying to pick a fight or something? No, no, we're sorry. Boy, she's got a temper. Better be careful and stay on her good side. <laughs> I know the switch is around here somewhere, but I can't get close to it because of the trap. Sounds like you've got a problem. That's what I've been trying to tell you. <gasps> Go on. Get. Leave no, me alone. Get. <laughs> this man. Uh, she's so mean. Duh. Huh? Life is a hard one, always working underground, but someone's got to do it. Go on, get your gar your varmint. Eh? Hey. How the fuck am I supposed to get the serpots past that? They'll die. They'll be fine. Okay. Go. Go, little freaking serpot. Go. <laughs> Only one. Oh no, no, why'd you come back? You flat! <laughs> no talent! <laughs> Do I have to go with them? I guess I have to advance with them. Can they die? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is chaos. Go! The Robo Boys are invincible. Are they really? I'm so worried they might die. Get it. Get the card. Miss Tron, look. We found a card key. I guess, yeah, I have a health bar. But I, I suppose they don't. So you can just send them in and not give a shit about what happens to them. They'll be okay. But they said they can feel pain! Can they really feel pain? Oh, we got a straggler. Maybe they, ju they just think they can feel pain, but they really can't. Oh wait, hold on a minute. I want to talk to her now that the trap's disabled. I've never heard a southern person what? say lads. You, you lads? You can't give that away! I'm just kidding. Sorry. We can't give this to you. <laughs> huh? We can't give this to you! Hey, lads be a little strange. <laughs> what the fuck is his accent? You lads be a little strange! It it's like southern and New York at the same time. I don't even know New Yorkers that say lads. It's, it's like she's suddenly Scottish? I don't understand. Oh, like Eric from Dragon Quest. Yeah, that would be that, that you know what that is? That is a New York Scottish man. Alright, here we go. Vinny says lads. Yeah, well, Vinny's Vinny. <laughs> He doesn't represent the average New York accent. <laughs> you mean it's important? Of course it's important! 
He says all kinds you of funny words. Or you'll all be in a lot of trouble. Yes, Miss Tron. Okay, so now I have a green card. What do I do with it? Huh? This is a really interesting game mode. Buy weed with it. Yes! Shut up! <laughs> Please! Bad! Bad chat. Think about what you've done. <gasps> I'm sorry! What the fuck? Reaver bots? Yo, those are, those are fucking reaver bots. Duh. <gasps> Can I destroy them? Oh no. Duh. I guess I gotta go sneak past them or something. Uh, okay. One, two, three. We're all past the reaver bots. Desert, do you like snake lizards as much as other lizards? Well, snakes aren't lizards, but yes, I do like hey, snakes. What's happening? What is this? Quite a lot, actually. I almost had a pet ball python at one point that I adopted, but I'm it didn't sorry, work out. But I can't move any further unless snakes are really cute. Yo, there's a switch over there! Let's play some Mario Odyssey! <gasps> Get it! Oh, fuck. Get it! Snakes are actually derived from lizards. It's, it's interesting. Uh, it's believed that, like, monitor lizards and geckos are actually the closest to snakes. Which, you don't really expect geckos to be part of that, but, like... They have very similar bone structures. And there's also a legless gecko that looks exactly like a snake. Why did they evolve without legs? That's actually a really uh, advantageous form for living underground. Believe it or not. Yeah, there's a legless gecko. Do they count as reptiles? Oh, yeah. I like when frilled lizards open their hoods and their mouths. It's so cute. It is cute. I miss my frilled lizard, Ian. They were a very good boy. All right, let's go. Wait. Uh. Huh? Who are you? My name is Pearl. I'm looking for huh? the Aurora Stones. Are Who this? Inside this room, but what? Inside here? Well, then, what are we waiting for? Huh? Wait! We're in trouble. It's a Reaver bot. It's a big one. I mean, huh? really big. Huh? Can I finish now? I was going to tell you that it sounds like. Well, guess what? There was! Come on, you guys, let's go! Miss Tron, what do you have to do? What if it's a really big and scary beaver bot? Well, he just said it was. What are you saying? We can't give up after coming this far! The treasure we've been looking for is in there! If you don't get it, I'll have to punish you all! Yes, Miss Desert, if snakes are evolved to live underground, then explain tree snakes. They are silly. Oh shit, <laughs> it's just a straight up reaverbot! Okay! Don't give up, 
What Look, about sea snakes? Move. Even sillier. Your heads. Look, see those fire traps all over the floor? You can use those to beat it. Stop whining. Oh, fuck, here he comes. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, shit. Uh, we gotta hit the thing on the ground. Go, 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 go. Whoa. All oh, the controls are kind of weird when you have to, like, do them fast. Explain dragons, a.k.a. air snakes. There are arboreal snakes that, like, know how to glide. It's actually really crazy. They are just the silliest of snakes. That's how, that's how we explain it in biology. Oh, you have to... I get it. Activate it. Get it! Burn him! Oh, flame, burn him! Duh. <laughs> oh, so you set one of your little dudes on fire, and then you have him run into him? That's hilarious. Go, my children, go! Burn! <laughs> this is so silly! Yeah, it's like Pikmin. It, it, this is literally Pikmin before Pikmin. Miyamoto, you got a lot of splaining to do! Cool. Oh, we did it. Oh, you can make him ha smack the switch himself. Shoot at the boss while it's on fire. I have a gun? Oh, wow, the little... Wow, my serve bot's on fire. I get you. Yeah, I could have done that. You're right. Eh? That's a refractor shard. Yo, I love this synth. From the color and size, it's fucking cat synth. Wow. I bet there's even bigger and better stuff in here. That's really pretty. Would you let me take care of that for you? It's the dancing. That's nice of you. The dancing road song. But just you wait and see. I'll get the next one. Or my name is... This game is very stupid and silly. I love it. <laughs> it's very good. This is charming as fuck. <laughs> it's a roach fractor shard. <laughs> oh, look at all the money we got. And an e-bottle. <laughs> and we got some brains. The new training room is ready for use. Okay. I have no idea what happened in that cutscene because of the music and the roach. Uh, we found something that was worth a lot of money, and now we sold it. That's all we really need to know. New training room, huh? 
Okay. Course 2. Select a serve bot. Why can I only select... Um, 1 through 8? Why can't I select, like, Greg? I want Greg! I want Greg! How do I get Greg? How do I get Greg in this? Because Greg is a failure. You take that fucking back! No, I want Greg! You should be able to. I don't know how. It won't let me scroll down. Change order. No. But it says it in his profile. Well, that doesn't make it true. He just needs more self-confidence. Start over. Yeah, I don't know how to- I don't know how to get, um, Greg in, into this mode. Doesn't look like I can right now. Is he on a mission or something? Uh, no, I don't think so. It just won't let me select past number eight. I also can't seem to get out. Oh, cancel. Maybe, do I need to like move? So, Greg into this room? Well, no, that's not it because there's like number nine and 38 and 13 and 12 are in here. Why can't I get Greg in here? What the fuck? You might need to play through the story modes first. Greg is being detained for beating up cops. <laughs> he did beat up a cop earlier. <laughs> Maybe he's not strong enough for course two. No, I had the same problem with course one. Yeah, I can only select these eight. It won't let me do anything else. All I know is you don't move serve bots around. Oh, the R buttons rotate them. Look at that. That is such a useless feature. I love it. <laughs> why is... Why can I do this? <laughs> okay. Split. <laughs> Great. Every game needs that. Does left or right go to the next thing? Uh, no, it doesn't. I don't think... Uh, nope. Um... Change order, maybe? Let's see... Location. No, it's just rearranging the fir- it, it, It's only selecting eight. What the hell? Can we tell you stuff you can give the serve bots? Yeah, sure, I just... Is there a way to make this list load other robots? Uh, that's, hmm. Select doesn't do anything. Start? Nope. You have to give them cookies. Yeah, there should be. I don't... If there's a way to do this, uh, maybe someone should look it up. Too many serve bots! Eh? I, I guess I'll try training number... number two again. Cannot be selected. Speed is maxed out. Oh, is this a speed test? The piano serve bot wants a shell, and you have the shell. Oh, okay. That'll inspire him to make music about the ocean. Do you want to hear the rules for this training game? Yeah, sure. You can only train the first eight until a certain point in the story. Oh, okay, thanks. That's good to know. In this game, you will have to hand out food to all the waiting serve bots. Oh god, it's burger time. Curry rice. Triangle is for curry rice. Square is for spaghetti. Super Mario and we are live. Spaghetti! Each serve bot's order will be shown at the bottom of the screen. If you can give each serve bot his 
food within the time limit, you clear the round. Each level is made up of three rounds, and if you clear a level, the speed rating of the serve bot playing will go up one point. Good luck! Uh, okay. A lunch, B lunch, C lunch. You have 36 seconds to get food ready for 20 serve bots. Star! Spaghetti! Spaghetti! No, fuck! D lunch! D I I'm doing it! Oh! Lunch. B 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 Yo, I'm, I'm turning off analog controls. Hold on a second. I think that was fucking it up. Analog mode, digital mode, go! Try this again. You won't be able to raise anyone's speed rating at this rate. Do you want to try again? Yeah, that was bullshit! Okay. It's fucking raw! Curry go! Rice. Curry rice! B lunch! B lunch! B lunch! A lunch! Curry rice! C lunch! C lunch! A 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 lunch! Spaghetti! C lunch! Oh god! Curry rice! Curry rice! A lunch! C lunch! This is really hard! C lunch! I did it. I did it. I did it. Spaghetti! Can you hold O and then do a direction? That's a... I, I don't know. I should try. Hey, lunch. Huh? Hey, lunch. Yes. No, you can't. No, no, you can't. Spaghetti. They actually hey, make lunch. it so you... That doesn't work. Hey, lunch. Hey, lunch. Oh, God. Hey, lunch. J Jesus. No, I hit it. Hey, lunch. No! D lunch. B lunch. Uh. A lunch. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. <laughs> D lunch. What the fuck is this game? D lunch. A lunch. B lunch. Uh. D lunch. No! I wasn't fast enough. Oh, come on! Who teaching these robots to eat sketty? I, I hit it! Spaghetti! Huh? Huh? I, I, I hit it though! I am hitting it! Spaghetti! No! Okay, that's how I Spaghetti. fucked up. Spaghetti! Uh, yeah, here you go. Oh fuck. <laughs> Uh, uh. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Oh, get it! D -lunch. D -d -d no, no! Oh! I, I did it. <laughs> I was so close to failing. Hey, how come? Where's the crab? Spaghetti. Maybe that's the um the sea lunch. Spaghetti. Uh, no! D lunch! A lunch! Uh, Spaghetti! Uh, D lunch! C uh, lunch! C lunch! C lunch! C lunch! Curry rice! Uh, C lunch! B lunch! Uh, no! Curry rice! What the fuck? Spaghetti! D lunch! C lunch! Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna get it! I'm not gonna get it! <laughs> Why is it working? I'm holding down! Uh, clunch. Blunch. The lunch. This is why I never want to work in fast food ever again. This is this is realistic. This is really, really how it be. Uh, 
Uh, Spaghetti. I can't keep up. Curry rice. Curry rice. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. Uh. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. Uh. Eat lunch. Curry rice. Oh God. Eat lunch. Uh. Jesus Christ, I, no! This is so bad for my anxiety. This is so bad for my anxiety! Do you little bastards even eat this food? What the fuck? See lunch. I would like a lunch. God, I'm too slow. I'm I'm being way too slow right now. No! I gotta step it up. God damn it! They are so angry. They are so angry. Somebody touch a mess, forget. Okay, a lunch. Curry rice. Curry rice coming up. Oh my god. No. Spaghetti. Oh Jesus. Uh. Boy, all you guys really want some curry today. Oh god. Uh. Go. I had two left. This is really hard! Oh fuck, I messed- I didn't mean to- uh, I didn't mean to do that. No, 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 I wanna go back. Uh, do I have to start over from the beginning now? Is it the same pattern? No, I think it's randomized. Speed is maxed out. Speed is maxed out. Oh my god. I have to start over again. You fool! What have you done? Spaghetti! Spaghetti! Be lunch! Be huh? lunch! Be lunch! Spaghetti! Uh. Student, thank you for the bits, dude. Thank you. Curry rice. Hey, hey, give me some curry rice. <laughs> give me some spaghetti. <laughs> Stop it, does it? Okay. No. Hold on, I got this. I got it now. Damn it! Yes, I want to try again. Spaghetti rice. <laughs> hey, so they they make uh, spaghetti out of rice now. Did you know that? It's it's gluten free. Curry rice. Spaghetti. 
I'm getting really good at this. I got the pacing. I got it. I got it. Rice is in gluten-free desert. All right, well, I agree to disagree. Yeah, I don't think rice has gluten in it. I'm pretty sure gl right, uh, Glyce doesn't have rooted in it. <laughs> yeah. Some rice has it. Yeah, some rice does. But m like brown rice, for example, does not. Yes, yes, rice has glue in it. That's why, that's why it's so high in fiber. It help the glue helps you poop. <laughs> it helps your poop together. <laughs> that's why it's white. <laughs> the gluten-free thing was a scam. Actually, it, um, I, I have uh, family members that actually, if they have gluten in their diet at all, they get like, Hives. No, celiac disease is real. As a fad to eat healthy, yeah, it, it went a little overboard. But no, there are legit people that are, that need that stuff, or they get sick. They get real sick. I think, um... I think a lot of people got attached to the gluten-free diet just because, I don't know, it does seem like healthier alternatives in some ways. It's just low-carb, and everyone likes low-carb diets and stuff like that, but it's not always low-carb, actually. Which is a bit of a... it's kind of a myth. Um, lots of gluten-free foods actually have a lot of carbs. Like that, like that Udi's bread. That actually is quite high in carbs. But it's gluten-free. Because carbs are great. Well, yeah, they are. Everyone loves carbs. Nah, gluten's not going to hurt you unless you have celiac disease. I have actually been trying to not eat as much bread lately. And I have found that, like, eating, eating too much bread, like, makes me feel weird. I don't know what that is. Uh, maybe it's like the reinforced flour or whatever the fuck. But, um... You know, like how, um, like... I don't know. Like, I, I guess Jimmy John's has, like, the Unwitch, which is, like, the lettuce sandwich without the bread. Or, like, you go to Jersey Mike's and they let you, like, get a sub in a tub where it's just, like, a salad. Like, you know? That's not a sandwich. I know! It's a wrap! It's a lettuce wrap, but it's good. I've, I've actually started trying to eat that more. And I feel like a lot of, like, excess weight is starting to, like, fall off me, too. And apparently that happens to a lot of people. I've noticed, um... I feel a little... My, my, uh, my parents noticed when they visited, like, they, they're like, Wow, you look, you look like you lost some weight there. And I'm like, oh, yeah. Yes, I did. I have stopped eating bread. Well, I still eat bagels. I'm never giving up bagels. Eating less bread means eating less carbs. Yeah, that's true. I get enough carbs as it is from like protein shakes and stuff, so I don't even need it. What are we doing? Curry rice! 
Hä? Hold on a sec. Okay. Uh, what are we doing? Tron's room. We can give her little friend on the piano the shell now, right? We will inspire them to make human music. <sighs> I can't do it! A lunch, C lunch, B lunch. How do I give them the thing? If I have the shell, how do I do it? Dinner. Hmm. Give is circle. Oh, thank you. Uh, comic. Give shell. I can hear the ocean. No, more than that. I can see it. The blue sky, the white sand, the waves. This, this is music too. Yes, this is what music's supposed to be. Miss Tron, I know what to do now. I, I can make music too. Number 36 gained the special skill, music. Oh, great. They're just gonna start, like, banging on the keys. <laughs> Miss Tron, if you find anything that a song could be written about, bring it here. I'll write a song just for you. Like, what if he just immediately, like, went back to the piano and it just started... <laughs> Hold on. Oh. I'm looking for that song. Get the motherfucking wigglin'. Ass gets to jigglin'. Motherfucking wigglin'. <laughs> Wait, what is the name of that song? <laughs> it's the Yin Yang Twins. You've ruined the joke, I know. It was funnier with that one time when I tried to find the skeleton twerking clip and it was just that song playing it like full fucking blast. <laughs> and I got so scared, I didn't know what was going on. Let's <laughs> get the jiggling. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> okay, um, I have a comic book. Who else needs that? Gotta keep working hard for this Tron. Number nine wants the comic. Oh, okay. Number nine? They were in the gym, right? I think. Let's see. So, talk to number nine. Miss Tron, look what I, what I found. What is it? Hey, this is the red head parts. When I was making number one, I tried using lots of different colors. I like red, but we didn't have enough zenny to use it for everyone. Good! I'd be embarrassed to have a red head! Huh? Really? I mean, I think it's great. It would make you stand out though, right? Say, there's an idea. I could use this to show everyone who my favorite serve bot is. Oh, I'm giving it to Greg. What do you say, number nine? If you work hard enough, I could put it on you. Nope, giving it to Greg. I'd like to be your favorite, Miss Tron, but I still don't want to wear that. We'll see about that. Anyway, give it here, please. Here you are, Miss Tron. You got the redhead parts. I gotta tell Nightbot to stop targeting links like twitch.tv. I don't know why it does that. I That's a mistake. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll fix that later. I think if you just like link it from the clips.twitch.tv link, it should be okay. I don't know why it's timing out. I, I, I need to fix that. I got to remember to fix that. 
Try- try loading it from the actual clip page. I mean, I don't really want to play it right now. I don't like playing my own clips, but <laughs> it was funny. LMAO, Servbot's twerking live on Twitch. You gave number nine the comic. Thank you, Miss Tron. I love comics. Wow, it's the latest issue of The Adventures of Sheriff Mega. Hmm, uh-huh. Is it interesting, number nine? I wouldn't get too close if I was you, miss. I'm just a drifter. Some say I'm a bounty hunter. But I like to think of myself as just a plain old gunman. Huh? <laughs> People like you was never meant to be with someone like me, miss. It's the fate of people like me to live our lives alone, living and dying by the girl. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, what are you talking about? Stop that nonsense! Can't stop much as I like to, miss. Ain't got nothing else. Just my horse and my girl. Number nine, are you okay? What the fuck happened to you? <laughs> he read a comic book and now he's a cowboy. Number nine! Huh? Miss Tron? I'm sorry, I guess I got a little carried away by the story. Time to hit the old dusty trail. Going to Tahiti with mangoes. I have a plan. Let's see. I don't have any other items right now, so I guess I'll go to HQ. You sound like Bobby Hill on Helium. That's my purse! I don't know you! Damn it, Dutch! I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dumb and thick! And the clap of my ass cheeks keeps her learning to Pinkertings! Hey, is that Arthur's big fat ass? <laughs> that is one of the funniest fucking sound clips I've ever heard in my life. Whoever did that, it, like, is spot on the voices for Red Dead Redemption. It's so good. Who made that? Oh, God. How was your Dutch impression? Oh, I don't even... I <laughs> Doesn't he sound like this? <laughs> Horther? Because he, ha he has like that like jump in his like throat kind of thing, right? Huh? It Horther? <laughs> that was almost goofy. <laughs> Kiwi B, thank you for the 22 months. It's very, very nice of you. I appreciate it. You sound like Pup Pal Rick. Hey, Pup Pal Mitch. <laughs> this is a free level? What the f- What is this? The goal of this mission is to find all the treasure buried inside the ruins. Is this like the, the dungeon crawling thing again? We haven't done this one yet. Bonk! Oh, ecstatic. Thank you for the 29 months. Thank you. What is this? What is a free mission? This is it. We're going to the Nakai Ruins. We're going to try and find Tiana's tear, right? That's right, but this is going to be harder than any other dig we've done. I mean, even Teasel wasn't going to try it alone. He took Bond with him. Does that mean we're going to give up? No. We might not be able to get it on the first try, but we'll keep trying again and again until we get it. Still, we need to be careful and retreat if things get bad. Oh, I think I... Let me guess, when you actually get it, the game technically ends, right? This is, this is like you're building up your resources to be able to tackle this specific thing. Is that how this works? No? Okay, then I'm totally wrong. Never mind. If we run out of energy in the ruins, we lose everything we found, so be careful. No, but it definitely helps. Okay. 
Am I just using the regular old robot with the gun? Okay. Can... I, I had the Gatling gun thing. Do I attach that to my robot now? Or maybe I should go... Upgrade my shit first before I try this one. Let me upgrade my stuff, if I can. How do I get out of this? Oh my god, that's a lot of head lows. I think you have to go to the lab. Right, but how do I exit out? You start it and then quit. Oh, there's no back button. Oh, boy. I might as well check it out then. Get all my fellas. Oh. Miss Trump. No, not yet. Huh? You guys gotta stop. You're gonna break Pagona Bot. Stop. Give him a break! He works so hard! Huh? Oh, okay, yeah, this is a lot like, um... So this is basically just Mega Man X mode, or Legends mode. Just a traditional style. <laughs> no! Oh! More or less, okay. So I'm going room to room then, and just grabbing treasure. Yeah, you can make them attack too. That's true. So I could like, just like Pikmin, really. <laughs> That's great, dude. <gasps> Ow! Oh wow, they do a shitload of damn. Wow! Oh my god. Get him! Ooh. Is that corn? Oh yeah, yeah, th this is corn in the future. It's uh, they, The corn is very aggressive. Did this game come out before Mega Man Legends 2 or after? I believe it came out before. Wow, this thing is tough. There we go. I am definitely unprepared for this. Order corn. <laughs> the lock-on's a lot better in this one, though, that's for sure. You can keep going a little further before it's too much. It's a cool mode, though. This game does a lot of neat shit. I'm surprised, like, I never hear about this game ever. You always hear about Legends 2, but you never hear about Tron Bon. Did people just, like, completely ignore this one? Oh my god. Ah, ah, ah! What's in it on the PSP, though? I don't know, I don't- I've never met anyone who has played this game. Until I, like, streamed it for just now. Suddenly, half my chat had played it. Apparently. It's pretty rare, it came out pretty late. Yeah, it's a 1999 PS1 game. Yeah, I- this is the PSN version, I'm playing this up with my PS3. Plays fine. It's really good. <sighs> Aggressive corn. Oh. 
There we go. Nice. Okay. So, send my little buddies to open the chest. What do we got? Brain cube. There was a brain cube in the box. The fuck's a brain cube? Is this anything? Nope. Can I pick this up? Oh, I- oh, I can. Oh, I could have probably used this as a weapon. Yep. It's a two million year old Rubik's Cube. Why did it explode? Everything in Mega Man games has to explode. That's just the way of life. It's- everything's a robot, even the rocks. Don't know why they're robots, but they are. What about implode? Ain't imploding just like exploding, but like in reverse? Yes, kind of. Snake? Snake! Get him! Huh? Huh? Oh wow, this thing does a lot of damage to you. Snake? Snake? Snarky. Ooh! There's a lot of damage. Go, 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 get him! They can't stop the snake, can they? I'm, I'm trying to, like, see if I can get them to, like... To, like, dogpile the snake. Maybe? Eh? You're not gonna let me do this, are you? No, they're too slow. Just gonna have to take it out the old-fashioned way. Can you- can you still, like, rapid-fire tap dance? No, they brought- they took it out of the game. No, you can't do that. Duh. The game was a very short print game, so it's very rare and obscure. Oh, okay. I'm glad they made it available digitally. Apparently the licensing for this game is, like, a bit fucky right now. And it was taken off, like, the Japanese stores or something? I got fireworks. Probably time to cut and run if you lose- if you die, you lose all you got. I got fireworks, I'm happy. Gotta get out of here. Uh, this is not the right way to go. Whoa, Rabbit, what's up? Thank you for the 14 months. How are you doing? That's another Surfbot item, you should give it to number 32. Okay. You own this in Dragon Ball Final Bout. I'm so upset I still own them. You don't still own them. Well, Final Bout. <laughs> is kind of like the most janky game I've ever played. I, I have played Final Bout and oh my God, this is a lovely room of death. Final Bout was the one with like the really weird voice acting, right? Can I leave? Uh-oh. I went the wrong way, and now I'm gonna pay the price. It was also, like, really experimental 3D fighting. Yeah, that's... 
That's like one of the worst DBZ games ever made. Well, technically it's GT. I am definitely gonna die in here. This is warm hell. Oh, fuck. Oh! No! Mr. Oak, are you all right? Well, there goes the fireworks. We need to regroup. <laughs> Everyone back to the Gessel shaft. Yes, ma'am. Get him another day. Damn, that shit's got a... They got a lot of health! Oh, this is like the failure music? Okay. We weren't able to complete this mission. Here are the surfbots whose brains ratings went up during this mission. Oh, okay, so you still, like, make a little progress. It gave me money. You get to keep the money, though. So that's good, but you don't get the fireworks. Are they gone forever? Uh, I don't know. I have no idea if they're gone forever. I... They'll be there again. Okay, good. So I guess I need to go to a lab and upgrade my mech. So... Like... Um... What, like bazooka parts? Number 31 gained a special skill, bazooka development. Okay. Uh, armor parts. That would be good to have. Tank parts! I can't- I just build everything, fuck! Oh, armor is 100 zenny. And I guess I should buy the E-Tank inks? Item E-Tank 1 is ready. E bottle. That's it, you should rob a bank in, in the video game. Yeah, I should. <laughs> no, really. Tank 2. I guess... Alright. What's... How... I, I guess I can just keep making these bottles? Does this... Is this something I should be doing or no? I need to get the armor. So I gotta save up to get the armor now. I should go rob a bank. Tanks for max HP... Bottles are a usable item. Those are consumables. Okay, okay. So, like... Let's go back to that. Yeah, let's go to the bank mission. I haven't done that in a minute. That just gives you 150,000! Alright! Let's go! When was your last save? Uh... I, I don't know. Like an hour ago? Huh? Uh-oh. It's the fucking vet again! What? Wait a second... Isn't this... Sorry... We ended up in front of the animal hospital again. <laughs> again? Don't you ever learn from your mistakes? Greg! Do this again! When we get back, I'm gonna have to punish all of you! Huh? Oh no! We're sticking with the plan. We're walking to the next town and robbing the bank. Roger! Roger. 
Damn it, Greg! Get to the next town and rob the bank. Uh, uh, okay. Here we go. How do I get to the next town? Can I still, like... Go away! Can I still, like, blow up houses and shit? Can I get the funny cutscene where they, like, start fucking with all the shit? Oh. Some extra cash. Okay. Go, go, go! No, you can't get that cutscene. Oh, it was so funny, though. Go away. <laughs> I just shot that kid! Go away! Go away! Oh, fuck. It's the po, -po. Duh. Duh. <laughs> Yay! Maximum carnage! Yeah, fuck the police! <laughs> They're so happy and excited. They love fighting cops. You should go rob the animal hospital. We've already blown up the animal hospital. They've suffered enough. I don't want to- I don't want to bring the cats and dogs into this! They're innocent! What is this, a convenience store? Get it! Bring me some snacks! Yes, and a comic book! Woo! Whoa! Oh shit! Huh? I don't think that was a comic book. Oh, what was it then? Uh, trying to lock on. I guess I should take out this fan because it's it's shitting out police. Ah! What? There we go. It's a servbot item. It's the stuff your father would read. Final Fantasy XIV strategy guides. <gasps> what? The dead pad stare. Surfbots are so good. How the fuck do we get out of here? Hey? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Look at them go! <laughs> are they gonna hijack the truck? <laughs> yes, they are! Who taught these baby bots to drive? <laughs> I love how it showed it like leaping off the bridge and it just falls straight the fuck down. <laughs> They're so happy about it. <laughs> They're too short to see over the steering wheel. They need, like, an inflatable booster seat. Jesus! The carnage! Okay. <laughs> I 
I love how they're just throwing the fucking cars at me. They're like leaping out. <laughs> That's fucked up, dude. <laughs> they're like literally using the car as like a fucking weapon. <laughs> Why do the police have fish-shaped spaceships? There's a lot of fish-shaped spaceships throughout Mega Man Legends. I don't know why it's a running theme. Oh, can I not take this one out? I can't take these out, can I? Restaurant! Whoa! Uh-oh. It seems like these armored cars can't be, like, destroyed. Uh... You can destroy them. You were hitting a tree. Uh... It doesn't seem like it! Send the babies to it. Oh, okay, hold on. I'm trying. Go, fuck it up. <laughs> Look at that Rocky the fan. Get it. The little tiny anarchists. Yeah, I don't. I don't think it. Uh. Oh, I just flattened my own baby. How, how the, what do I do with this? Oh, you rock it and then run by it. I get it. Okay. How do I, like, heal? Items. E-bottle. Oh, that's a cool-looking sprite. Oh, yeah, there we go. Bro, I got ice cream. I got a hamburger. Huh? There it is. The bank. Get it! Oh, too far. You stole three riot shields. They weren't using them. <laughs> what is this song? Oh god, it's her again. VR training, huh? Kids wired with nano machines. Huh? Whoa! What the fuck? He just so she just suplexed me! She just judo threw a fucking power suit! Whoa! Oh my god! <laughs> That's so fucking funny. <laughs> she has the power of God and anime on her side. Don't fuck with her. No! <laughs> Is she a cyborg? Well, technically, they're all like reploids. Oh, my God. Damn. Get away from me. Surbots, go. The Swactor! Oh my god! Look at her! Look at her! <laughs> so long, Bowser! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh shit! She's fucking coming! Ooh! I'm getting yeeted! 
Ooh. Oh my god. Why? Why are you so fast? Why is it? Stop throwing me! What? How do you outrun her? I don't think you can. I don't think you can outrun her. You have to shoot her to make her stop. <laughs> what sort of VR training was she doing? Holy shit. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> but when she has iframes, you can't shoot her. You have to throw some shit at her. She's coming! She's coming! What the fuck are you gonna do when she gets here? Oh my god! What are you gonna do when I get there? I'm coming! I'm coming closer! Duh. Just keep your distance. Duh. Oh, got her! Desert, what about the bank? Don't worry. The bank has been taken care of. <laughs> Good. Look at him go. Look at him go. <laughs> Good job. This game is so fucking funny, dude. Home. This is great. Yes, it's fun. I love this. I'm so glad I decided to actually pick this up. <laughs> Is this the best you can do? Even after your special training? Maybe you should consider another line of work. Maybe, maybe you're right. I try and I try. Yeah, maybe she should be like in the martial arts or something. Right. I don't know, man. Mode almost, dude. Again. Why can't anything go right? If that could rescale Maybe to like be an emote, that would be so fucking good. Top. Cheer up! Something's bound to go right for you sooner or later. You just have to keep your chin up. Come on, guys, let's go home. Yes, yes it's fun. We're going to gold. We took all the gold, baby. enough something good will happen i hope at least you're seeing like the positive in this <laughs> god <laughs> you know beyond the fact that the bank got fucking blown up and robbed and now the economy's probably screwed people might have died in there but you learned something today <laughs> And that's what really matters. <laughs> we were able to sell the gold we got from the bank for 150,000 zenny! These were all the things we were able to get on this mission. We got pork, fish, curry, hamburger, and three riot shields, and a comic book. A design magazine. Got some brains. Are they using a gold standard? I assume they are if they have gold bullions inside of the bank. I assume, you know, a lot of... I I'm assuming gold is very valuable in a society that is mostly based on electronics and robotics. Considering it's a very powerful conductor. Yeah, I would say gold is probably extremely valuable in this world. So now I can build things again. It's also shiny as fuck. Uh, y you know what? You're right, though. There's also a lot of water. Yeah... But it's not as cool as if there was a lot of soda. 
Let's get some armor. Oh. Oh, you can use the ride shields. Okay. And then... We'll build it. Water is better than soda. Okay, well... That's debatable. You're right, though. I don't drink a lot of soda anymore. In fact, I try not to. I drink a ton of water. In the last, like, two years, I've made a very, very strong effort to drink just more water. Water and tea. It's for the better. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Water is good for you. I should buy some of these. Can you buy more than one at a time? Nope. Okay. You have to just buy them individually? Uh, where was the bot that wanted the thing? Was it bot number 32? Someone wanted the thing that I just got. Number 40 should be in Tron's room. Oh, okay. In the meeting room? Well, let's see. One, two, three, four, five! One, two, three, four, five! What are you doing, number 40? This is called facial aerobics, Miss Tron! But you don't have face muscles! Oh god, do you guys remember the Japanese facial aerobics thing that I <laughs> The fucking... Wait a minute! Where is it? Oh god. Face exercises. Uh What what is that device called? Exercise device for your face. Japanese exercise face. Face exercise. No, 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 no. It was a facial fitness pal. Yes! This. This. Please play. <laughs> Here we go. Oh no, no, you don't want you don't want that. You don't want to get older. Getting older is terrible. But you don't have to get older. Check it out. <laughs> Introducing the seagull pacifier. <laughs> <laughs> this is so fucking good. Just tones you the fuck up. Look at this. Look at this. You want to look youthful like that? You can start at any age. It's not too late to start now. <laughs> 30 seconds twice a day. Not too much though, or you'll fly away. <laughs> One minute a day. I have seen this shit on Toraba. <laughs> look at them go! Look at them! Look at them doing the business suit! <laughs> wow! Look at the difference! This dude does not know what's going on. He looked at. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! No, 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 no. No. He looks exactly the fucking same! <laughs> he looks exactly the same! <laughs> For the best smile. Look at those stock photos. <laughs> well, his teeth are whiter, does it? Oh, that's great. Did that, did that, did that help? With that? <laughs> Tron's face reflects your feelings for that video. <laughs> That shit is so funny to me. Just one minute a day, chat. <laughs> That's all you need. <laughs> I'm imagining this serve bot with the fucking flapping fucking pacifier in his mouth. <laughs> what are you doing, number 40? I'm doing this for 30 seconds. One minute a day. <laughs> It really works! Facial aerobics? Yes, 
Yes, Miss Tron, you can keep your skin young and healthy by exercising your face! <laughs> I read all about it in this book! I know that. What I want to know is why are you doing it? You don't have any skin! But Miss Tron, I just thought we should all look our best! You look good enough! Oh. Well, I agree with that. I think he looks great. You gave number 40 the design magazine. <gasps> eh? Oh. Number 40 gained the special skill design. What, they didn't like it? Why did, why did he fall asleep to it? Just look at these curtains. This won't do. We simply have to change them right away. <gasps> oh, I need to give the redhead part to Greg. This game is so fucking bizarre. I love it, though. <laughs> In the Japanese version, the design magazine is called an adult magazine, and he's... He what? He starts... No. No. You're lying. He does not start sniffing the bed. No, he does not. No, he does not. Japan, explain. Look it up. I don't want to look it up. I don't want to look it up. Next bit. Next bit. Desert, can I sniff your bed? You don't want to do that. You don't want that. No. Bad chat. No. I want to give Greg the thing. I need to give Greg the thing. Chat, I'm giving Greg the thing now. Give Greg redhead parts. I was thinking about giving my favorite surf bot the redhead parts, but I have to make sure I give it to someone I can count on to do a good job. Give it to Greg. <laughs> give it to Greg. I'm sure I can trust Greg. <laughs> Absolutely. With your life. <laughs> Craig became the favorite servant. Look at his hat! He's got a red head! <gasps> his max attack rating is now four. Oh, shit! His attack rating is now two. Go, oh, Greg got ups. Oh, fuck! Talk to number one, then give the item to number 17. Eh? What item? Oh, does he give you something? Hold on. I gotta... Number one, you're the oldest, so you have to keep your eye on everyone, understand? Yes, Miss Tron. I've kept a diary explaining how to do everything. Really? Let me see. Wow, this is great! You've done a good job! Thank you, Miss Tron. You can keep it and use it if you want. All right, thank you. No, Miss Tron, the pleasure's mine. You got strategy notes. Okay, so you want to give that to number 37, not 17. Where is 37 then? Is that the strategist one? Let's see. Oh, there he is. Oh yeah, he's the nerd. I remember now. Ah, Miss Tron, I'm currently engaged in a study of tactics and strategy. I'm sure it will be of great use to you once it's finished. If only I had some better resources. Name him Kleiner. You can't fit the Kleiner! <laughs> you can only use four letters! I would, though. Stop! No! See. Give strategy notes. Name him Stop. <laughs> you gave number 37 the strategy notes. Well, 37, think that will help you? Flip, flip, flip. This, this is amazing. 
Wait! Hold on a minute! Scribble, scribble, scribble! I... I did it! It's finished! I can see it! I understand everything! It's all clear to me now! Number 37 gained the special skill strategy. I believe I can be of great service to you now, Miss Tron. If you have any questions about how to proceed, feel free to ask me. Okay, but remember, there's more to life than just books. You need to get out sometimes, okay? Let's see. I really wish you could use more letters. Him. So when do you get to use these skills, though? That's what I want to know. Like, how, how do you wind up using them? Music. Name him Nerd. But that's mean. Oh, are people cashing in peas? Y'all peeing too much. Stop peeing all over the chat! That's quotes. Can we name the chef, Chef? <laughs> Craig the Failure. <laughs> Poor Greg. Desert, we want to show you how hard we can pee. Well, that's very nice. I don't want to see. <laughs> oh god. Uh, let's go to HQ. Save. Name number seven Earl. Why? What, 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 why, why Earl? What is number seven stats? Wait a minute. Um. What do you go to? You go to, uh, not system. Talk. Huh? I heard that Master Teasel borrowed a million zenny. I promise I'll work hard and help as much as I can, so we can get the money paid back to that loath fellow and get Master Teasel back! Let's see, list. Number seven is Sirius. Why would you name him Earl? Number six is Jeff. I wish I could rename them from this screen, but you can't. I guess I don't have these surfbots yet. Like, I gotta find them or something? Uh, wait. What is this one doing? Oh, this one has a vacuum cleaner. This one has, like, a little broom. This one has flags. This one doesn't do anything. Binoculars. Huh? <laughs> Winner Titan! Hey, thank you very much, Winner! That's very kind of you, dude. Jesus, you've gifted a lot of subs in the channel. Thank you, man! I, I very much appreciate that. I hope everyone who got those does. Goodness. Very, very kind of you, man. How do you get these bots? Do you just have to play the story for them, or, or what? Desert, name one fuck. <laughs> Wait, which one should I name fuck? This one, the romantic. 
Him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Him. He. Number 40. No, number 40 is innocent. We can't name them fuck. No, 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 why do you want to name them swears? <laughs> Anon, thank you for the gift sub as well. Thank you very much. That's very kind of you guys. Name one shit. I don't like this. I don't like this. They deserve real ass names like like Greg and and stop. <laughs> I hope you guys never own serve bots, because you would just name them dirty things, and then they would be very upset with their lot in life. Name one Doug. That's a good name. I like Doug. Eh? Number six. I don't even remember who number six was. Name one Boob. No! No. No! That's enough. That's enough. That's- this is- You guys are being bad. I'm done. I'm done for tonight. You know what? I'm actually done. Not a bit. Nah. I I'm actually, um... I'm actually kind of tired. <laughs> no, really. I am, uh... I'm gonna call it a night here. We'll, we'll pick this up again later. This was a lot of fun. I really like this, actually. It's, uh... It this is a lovely little game. It's really interesting, and it's really unique. And I, I guess it's also rather short, so, like... I guess we could probably finish this within, like, two or three streams, maybe? So, we'll see this again. Short games are nice. I've been playing a lot of long-as-fuck games lately, and it's nice to have, like, you know, just a little fun diversion. Every now and then. Also, the sprite art is fan-fucking-tastic. Beautiful game. Can we at least name the others in this room? We'll, we'll name them all probably in time. But thank you for hanging out for uh, Tron Bond, uh, the misadventures of Tron Bond. I, again, very surprised with this game. It's it's rather good for a game I haven't heard a lot about. I was very, very curious what the hell this game was, and it's just, it's just fun. It's just fun. Also, Torre-san, thank you for the six months. Name a bot, Nips. All right, that's enough. Good night. Bye-bye.